taking a look at the last five seasons for Tampa, trying to win their second straight Atlantic Division crown as well as their second straight Eastern Conference title. You can see what they've done the last six seasons. Uh, no Stanley Cup championship and that is uh, in the end the ultimate goal for all teams uh, entering the playoffs coming up in about a week yeah. and a half's time. Uh, we always talk about teams wanting to get better and the Bolts it's hard to do when you're at yeah. the top of the craft for as long as they have been but when you watch this team over the last couple of weeks are, are is this a team that's continuing to make steps and strides in the right direction? Yeah I think they are and and really we we point to that graphic we just showed you Jamo and I think it really you know the point I would make is the the good teams, the ones that ultimately go on to win the big prize, reader, and you've seen this, uh, is is a team that has essentially that core been through a similar set of experiences together. You've come close, but you've lost it. Yeah. You've had high expectations, but you failed to meet them. You've gone through that adverse condition together, and it builds that common understanding as a core group. Uh, you've got something to draw from, and I think that really bodes uh, in the favor of the Bolts as they kind of look towards the postseason this year this time around where do you find the motivation to carry it to that next level where do you find the motivation when there really isn't much outward motivation out there you've kind of had your way with the NHL to this point so I think it's that that experience of having been uh, you know been expected to go deep but failed to get there that helps this group kind of galvanize and draw from as they look towards that second week of April when the playoffs start this year. No oh, absolutely and not only the guys who are in Tampa Bay but you've got three guys who played in New York who went to the Stanley Cup finals. This is a yeah. veteran group of players that understand that the playoffs are what it's all about and you know you, you hear the saying all the time in sport and not necessarily always in pro sport but in minor sport college sports you have to lose before you win and you have to learn how to win uh, anybody can lose and the majority of teams do lose because at the end of the day there's only going to be one team that wins so losing is something that you have to understand what it takes to get past that level of losing and even if you lose in the Stanley Cup final at the end of the day you still have something to prove and get better on it. and that's what the Chicago Blackhawks have done or the, not the Chicago Blackhawks as I look at this uh, board that's what the Tampa Bay Lightning have done is that they have learned through the course of their losing opportunities that I have to be better every single day and then you break it down into not just every single day uh, every practice every drill and practice I have to be better in a game it's every shift it not, it, you break it down from period to shift and at the end of the day and even at practice the players on the winning teams and these top teams and you see the board of the the, the president's trophy winners and <clears throat> I was very fortunate I, I have won three president's trophies and two of those I won a couple of Stanley Cups so I'm not on that side of saying well the president's trophy means nothing I think it means a lot and it teaches play, players and especially Tampa Bay right now that you have to win every game. You have to be ready to play every single game of the 82 game season because you have to prepare for any situation that could come up in the playoffs. And that's what Tampa has done all season long. They're not a team that's like, ah, this game means nothing. We're not going to worry about it. They're a team that when they're supposed to win, they put the pedal to the metal. And if they finish the game and they win by three, I'll bet if you ask the players, to a man, they would all say, yeah, but we could have done this better. Yeah, but we could have done this better. And that's the sign of a true champion is when you win a game and you're not satisfied that your game was, wasn't the perfect game. And Tampa has lost enough, yeah. and they've got such a great team right now. And to a man, that team, I mean, their third and fourth lines are better mm -hmm. than a lot of teams' second lines. And they outplay them because they learn from the stars on the team that I want to be better every single day in the Kucherovs, the Stamkos, the Hedmans. These guys are better every single day since they've come into the National Hockey League. And this year they've just been uh, absolutely tremendous.